Greetings everyone, Digital Extremes have announced Warframe on PlayStation 5 and alongside the announcement we have extra information on improvements that players on the platform will see. Playing throughout the video is DE's announcement with the PS4 vs PS5 comparison video. You can see improvements such as loading into the Plains of Eidolon taking 10 seconds rather than 41 seconds on top of visual improvements. The PlayStation 5 version of Warframe will have dynamic lighting thanks to new rendering technology and Digital Extreme states that on next-gen hardware, Warframe will look and play better than ever, running up to 4K resolution at 60fps. Now on screen right now is a snapshot from the PS4 version of Warframe and on screen now is the screenshot from the PS5 version of the game. These texture improvements will be game-wide, not just exclusive to the open landscapes, and once again, it'll look like this on the next-gen hardware of the PS5. Digital Extremes also shared the following information via a Q&A in relation to the PS5 release of the game. Can PS4 and PS5 players play together? Yes, if you upgrade to PlayStation 5, you will still be able to play with your squad on PlayStation 4. So PlayStation plays, enjoy a bit of crossplay. Will PS4 and PS5 updates be simultaneous? Yes, future updates will be simultaneously released across both the PS4 and PS5. Will next gen have cross save? There will be cross save only between PS4 and PS5. When will Warframe launch on next gen? Warframe is launching on PlayStation 5 this year, but if you're a Tenno on Xbox, stay tuned for more information in the future. Is there account migration from PC to PS5? At this time, we are not allowing account migration from PC to PS5. Will Warframe support 4K resolution 60fps on PlayStation 5? Warframe on PlayStation 5 will support up to 4K resolution and 60fps. Will Warframe support adaptive triggers on the DualSense controller? Yes. Haptic feedback will be tied to firing your weapons. An enable controller trigger effect option will be available in the settings should players wish to disable the feature. Will PS4 trophies transfer to PS5? While your progress will transfer over to PS5, your trophies will not, which means that you will have to re-unlock trophies as you play. Cumulative trophies like Shield Saver, aka Deflect 1000 Bullets with Melee Weapons, will transfer over at 99% completion. So in the case for Shield Saver, you will simply have to deflect a single bullet with a melee weapon in order to unlock it. However, Single action trophies earned from activities like completing quests will have to be redone, with some of them requiring other steps to fully unlock. So for quest trophies, you will just have to replay the quest from the codex. The This Is What You Are trophy of fully unlocking a focus skill tree. If you already unlocked all the focus trees, you will just have to change your configuration once to get the trophy on the PS5. For the reach rank 30 on whatever weapon type trophies, you will have to reach rank 30 on the weapon specified. Will the upcoming 7 year Warframe PS4 anniversary also be celebrated on the PS5? Yes, everything coming for the 7 year anniversary on PlayStation will also be available on the PS5. Stay tuned for more information when the anniversary does go live. Will PlayStation Plus be required to play Warframe on the PS5? No. As is the case with the PS4, it will not be required to play Warframe on the PS5. And then for Xbox players, is the Xbox Series X version backwards compatible? We'll have more information to share about Warframe on the Xbox Series X very soon. So this post was all about the PlayStation 5. There is your information from the post itself for console players looking to get the PlayStation 5 version of Warframe.